That was quite the sight. Yeah, it was quite the team effort, Amy, between Detroit police and Westland. First tracking the suspect down, learning that he's at a gun range in Westland, and then moving in as a unit to make the arrest. This man being led away in cuffs is the result of a plan put into action. Acting on a tip, police officers positioned themselves and then waited for the right time to act. Kept noticing all the police cars and undercover cars moving around. It was around 4 p.m. when Randall Woodell noticed something was happening at the business next door, the firing line gun shop. Wasn't quite sure of exactly what was going on, but I figured there was something going to happen. Police from Detroit and Westland positioned themselves near the store on Ford Road near Vinoy. Randall says he could feel the tension in the air. You could definitely tell something was getting closer and going on. Yeah as, you know, the cars kept moving closer and closer. As soon as the suspect emerged from the gun shop, they moved in and arrested him in the parking lot without incident. Sources tell Fox 2 he was wanted for a felonious assault out of Detroit. According to the owner of the firing line, the suspect was teaching a private lesson at the firing range. He says at no time was anyone in the store in danger. Knowing the folks that work next door here, they're very good people and they would never put anybody in jeopardy. Police were able to make the arrest and impound the vehicle without anyone getting hurt. As for who the suspect is and what crime he's accused of, police say they're not ready to release those details at this time. Reporting live in Detroit tonight, Dave Spencer, Fox 2 News. And Dave, you mentioned that he was giving a private lesson. So did he actually work at the firing range or just happened to be at that spot for this lesson? How did that go? Right, yeah, the owner said he did not recognize them. He was not an employee. He was simply using the store to teach a private lesson. He had no prior uh, contact with this person other than what happened today.